I'm so mad about what's happened with our kids that it, it's very hard. I'm losing respect mm -hmm. for him in that, res in that regard. Bodhi says he feels disrespected by you. Well, it's mutual. I think it's a, it's a two-way street there. I think if he had truly been watching out for me and my children, he would have figured out a way to make it work for the whole family instead of having his rules and hanging out with the wife, staying where he, is, he was respected and obeyed. Hi, my name is Zoe, and whether you're here for drama, tea, conspiracies, or just to spend a little bit of time with me, I really appreciate it. I hope you like and subscribe to the video. Today, obviously, I'm going to be talking about the Brown family <laughs> and a little bit about TLC, too. I've been thinking about making this video for a long time about Cody Brown and his faults as a father to multiple families. Um, but obviously with the tragic events that have happened, I put a pause on it. But now thinking about it, I mean, everything that they've done, they've made public and put on TV. So I feel like it's okay if I talk about it. And I have kind of a rocky relationship with my dad. So, I might have a little bit of an outside good view to put on all this. If you clicked on this video, I'm going to assume you already know who Sister Wives and the Brown family are, but I'm going to give you a really quick little family tree of them. So, you have Cody Brown, who is the main man of the family. Obviously, he's the singular husband. You have his first wife, Mary Brown. They have one child together, Leon. And then you have his second wife, Janelle. They had five children together, Logan, Maddie, Hunter, Garrison, and Savannah were Janelle and Cody's children together. And they have five children together as well. They have Aspen, McKaidi, Peyton, Gwen, Isabel, and Truly, who's pretty young. And I have a video about her I'm going to show in a little bit. And then the fourth and most controversial wife um, is Robin. She joined the family in the first season. And I actually rewatched some of the first season before I made this just to kind of get a new view. Um, <laughs> Christine was very unhappy and uncomfortable with the entire situation from the beginning. But Robin has three children of her own. She has... Dayton, Aurora, and Brianna. Those are with her first husband. And she also has Solomon and Ariella with Cody. The crazy thing about Robin is her ex-husband is actually Christine's first cousin and Cody's third cousin. Not exactly sure how that works out, but kind of weird. Robin met Cody when she attended one of her friend's church services and they kind of hit it off. But honestly, if you ask my opinion, Robin is the reason that the family fell apart. Pretty obvious. I made this video because I found a lot of little videos on TikTok showing kind of how horrible of a dad he was. As I mentioned, I was going to show this video of him talking about Truly when he was getting the divorce recently with Christine. Um, Truly was still pretty young and I lost my dad. I didn't lose him. I lost my mom when I was eight and my dad kind of left two years later and I didn't see him for a long time. And the way she talks about it, I mean, you're the dad. You should have done a little bit more maybe, but just take a look at this. But she seemed very okay. I haven't really talked to dad a lot about the divorce. He just basically told me, like, um, you found out about the divorce, and I was like, yeah, I'm fine with it. And he was like, okay. So it never really went beyond that. I'm sitting here with Truly, kind of glad that she's not brokenhearted about the divorce, and even somewhat shocked, in a way, even in spite of how much she loves this house and everything, I'm sort of shocked that I mean, the way he talks about his kids is like he's waiting for them to do something, which is ridiculous. I mean, I'm not going to get into the semantics of how you parent your children, 
there's a baseline of care and support and acceptance that your children are supposed to feel from you that he does not give to his kids. I mean, here's another example of Christine talking about how he, it's weird that he would leave the other wife's house to go help Robin, get the kids ready for school, because he never did the same for any of the other children. Here's that clip. Remember a time ever where Cody left Robin's house to come over to my house to help get my kids off to school. Well, I just think it's disgusting. You would leave one wife's home to go help the other kid, the other wife's kids get ready for school. What, can't she help get her kids ready for school when he's not there so he can spend more time with the wife where he's at? Lehigh Logan was getting my kids ready to go out the door to school. I don't know where Cody was. I was actually taking Ariella and Solomon to school because I liked it. We were just working so hard to make ends meet before and now the way he talks about it kind of grosses me out because you have been doing sister wives since the beginning you've been making money you've been i mean you could have been there to get your kids to school it's not that hard to work out a schedule obviously playing favorites and it's really sad to see the other wives start admitting this and then you have to think the other children are going to see this and that brings me to my main point of making this entire video is can TLC get a wrongful death lawsuit for what happened to Garrison considering that they're putting out all these edits and all these horrible things that are being said about the children of this family by Cody himself. I mean, look, imagine being a child and having to watch this kind of stuff over and over and over again. Just look. Okay, I just got off the phone with Garrison. Oh my goodness, stupid stuff. He's like blaming me for all the stuff going on in our family. This has gone too long. Garrison, who, who I asked to move out of the house probably six months ago, and then he's mad at me that I'm not coming around. And he basically just tried to cut relationship. I love you, dad, but this is goodbye for Garrison's like, dad, you're being a hypocrite. You're not coming around. And I about lost and I'm telling you, he's calling me a hypocrite when he's the one that can't be an adult and go get a place. It's just, we need to think about children more and think about our responsibility as parents to our children. I mean, basically, basically, our feelings don't matter. If you're talking about your feelings in a way that are superior to your children or you're favoring certain children, like Dalton was an adult living at the home, Robin's child, not biologically Cody's, Robin's child Dalton was living at the home while he was trying to get Garrison to move out and I can't imagine the psychological damage that had on him as a child. And especially him saying things like this. And now that I have a chance to do this with Solomon Ari, it's like this, like it's, it's like this second chance. But Robin never asked me to do it. I'd be like, oh, I think it's gonna create problems. When I would bring it up to him, he'd just like, stop it. Like, this is what I wanna do. I'm tired of being blamed for the bad sister wife. A bad sister wife is someone who just monopolizes the husband so he has no time for anybody else. A bad sister wife takes her kids away from her husband. I really and hope that's exactly what Christina's Cody done. and TLC take a step back and have the mindfulness to cancel sister wives. Obviously, this polygamous lifestyle wasn't the best setup for these children. Um, the father splitting his time between all these houses, very stressful. Obviously the kids are gonna feel like their favorites being played and certain houses aren't getting as much attention and blah, 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 blah. But besides that, the fact that they can have all this video out, these families, deepest moments and deepest thoughts just out for everybody to see and to be played over and over again. Like, I don't know. They need to keep kids out of reality TV. They need to 
cancel Sister Wives. There's no reason to keep it going. All of Garrison's friends want it canceled. I can't really see Janelle wanting to do it anymore after Garrison's death. Cody, obviously, it's just in a monogamous relationship now with Robin and favors her children over his own biological children. They have two children together, but still, it's insane to me. It's worth re-watching it, um, but if a new season comes out, I'm probably not going to watch it. And that's sad because I love reality TV. <clears throat> anyway, ending this video... Sorry if I was a little all over the place. I haven't been making videos for a while because of personal reasons, you know. It's hard. If you watch Garrett Watts, I feel like I'm going to end up on his upload schedule. Hopefully not. Maybe I'll get as likable as him someday. Such a sweet man. Uh, but anyway, do something nice this week. My kids have been on spring break. Maybe yours are too. Try to take them outside and do a scavenger hunt in the backyard or something nice and fun. I hope everybody has an amazing day. Please leave a like and subscribe on this video even though it wasn't my best one. Bear with me. It means the world and I really am just trying to get out there. Um, but again, it's look into this situation yourself. It's amazing the amount of videos you can find where Cody is just being a very deplorable sad excuse for a father and man in my humble opinion but have an amazing day guys and like i said do something nice for yourself your kids anybody else just send positive vibes out there bye guys